Hi, it's Liam here from Muscle Doctor, and today I've got a rotator cuff warm up for you. Now, this is perfect for warming up the shoulders before any kind of pressing movements. Before we get into the exercise, it's important to understand what the rotator cuff does. So, the rotator cuff rotates the arm externally, internally, and abducts. So, first, we're going to look at external rotation. Now the muscles involved with external rotation are teres minor and infraspinatus. And all we want to do with external rotation is simply externally rotate the arm. Now we're always going to be wanting to work against gravity, so standing up is fine for this one. So we can start off with something as simple as a bottle of water, nice and light. And we can start in this position here, and we're just going to bring it up to 12 o'clock and back down to 9 o'clock. We can just repeat that and we should feel the movement get a little bit easier. We can make those muscles of the posterior rotator cuff do the work for us. So when you find that's easy enough, you can move on then to something a little bit heavier. I've got a dumbbell. There's about four kilos on this dumbbell. So again, exactly the same. Starting position, finish position. And the aim is to keep that humerus and keep the upper arm in a nice straight line and just let the rotator cuff muscles do the work. So we can progress that further to give us a slightly different feel. We can use a resistance band. So I've got my trusty black band here. What I'm gonna do is stand on it. And what that's gonna do is give us more resistance at the top of the movement than the bottom. So same as before, we start at nine o'clock, we rotate round to 12. What's nice about this is that as the movement starts to get easier near the top, the resistance increases, flattening out the strength curve. So next up is abduction, and for this, I'm gonna grab my trusty black band again. And because of the resistance of this band, putting it underfoot is actually gonna to be too much resistance for a warm up for the rotator cuff. So what we can do is just put it down underneath our backside, Bring it up, check, everything's fine there. Back down to the starting position. And we're just gonna abduct the arms. And what we're doing here is warming up the supraspinatus, which is the uppermost rotator cuff muscle, as well as the deltoids. So next up is internal rotation. And we're gonna to need to find somewhere where we can lie down here because we need to work against gravity. So I'm gonna use my treatment couch. You can use the floor, a bed or a sofa, but with a place like this, it's perfect because we can actually go beyond parallel, which is nice, just to get into a bit of a stretch there, the internal rotators. So the movement we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be starting at three o'clock here the right arm and then up to 12 o'clock so you can see we're going through exactly the same range as we were with the external rotators but this time because we're lying down we're working against gravity with the internal rotators so we can start off with something as light as a bottle the key here is control so we're not necessarily training these muscles we're just warming them up and activating them so we can do a few reps that's feeling good so we can progress To the dumbbell, exactly the same thing, about four kilos on here, it's just enough for me. And the muscle we're working here is subscapularis, so it's on the inside of the shoulder blade. And the more you do this, the more you should be able to feel that muscle doing the bulk of the work. Okay, so feeling good, we can progress again. So I'm going to improvise here, I've got the band, and we can put it underneath the couch, wrap it around, and then hold on to this side of this arm, and then we can bring it up, and we've got the resistance of the band to work against, which is really nice, it actually feels a lot nicer because of that strength curve being flattened out. 
You want to increase this and progress even more. Just pull a bit more of the band through. That resistance increases. So that's my warm up for the rotating cuff. If you liked it, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.